And like, I really mean that because it was last September, we were working on another project at the time and our lead actress in that project had to um, pull out temporarily because she got cast as a series regular in Bridgerton, fucking show. <laughs> and uh, so we thought, okay, well we're not going to be able to do much over the winter, so we can either take the winter off, do not all that much, you know, kick about, fucking wish I'd done that, or do this instead, and, uh, and that's what became this thing, which kind of spiralled out of control. Um, huh? I wasn't practicing. Um, so that, and that's really where it came from. You know, it, it was a very short process. Um, I pitched it to um, my wife and my other wife. Um, <laughs> and uh, it, it could just kind of roll from there, wasn't it? It was, it was a quick process said, hey, what about this idea of, of a car? If, if you, a Tesla is tethered to your phone, I wonder if, if a, a similar car, not necessarily that one, could be, you know, could, could you hack that and hack the car through it? And that was really where it came from. And uh, so we did the script really quite quickly. Um, got Kevin on board again, reasonably quickly. Shot it in January. Post-production through February, March, and we were in Canada in May. Um, it's the sales and all that shit that's taken all of this time. So, uh, so we've been done. I haven't seen this film in six months. So, you know, if it's, if it's shit, I apologise. Um, <laughs> so, uh, yeah, uh, I, I just had um, uh, yeah, a couple of uh, quick notes. One thing we can't actually say for contractual reasons is what the budget was. Um, but what I can tell you is it cost what Barbie averaged in sales every 18 minutes in its theatrical run. <laughs> so if you've got the time to do what I did and sit down and work that out, you'll be able to get our budget. Um, and yeah, as it stands as of now, this small gap filler project has now already sold in over 40 countries and has already broken even. So really... <laughs> What I have to say though, I mean, my name is kind of Plaster. I would not be here if it wasn't for all our cast and crew who are here tonight, um, who all did so much for so little on this project, but especially it's these guys here, it's, it's their film. So yeah. Thank you to you guys, it is, it is yours, and you did just as much, so it's here, thank you very much. And what, the only thing I've got to say is please, at the end of the film, just stay seated just for two minutes, if you can bear staying that long, just give me an extra two minutes at the end, just for our cast and crew that are here, and because it's still a bit funny, there's just a little making of highlights thing, just to a bit of music, just for uh, literally a couple of minutes, and then we can go to the bar and get a drink or whatever. So uh, thank you, that's it from me, but I'd add if you've got anything else. Hello everyone, uh, thank you so much for coming down tonight, it means the world to us that you've come to support us all. Uh, I just want to say a, a few thank yous uh, to echo what Jean said, um, thank you so much to our cast and crew who put so much into this to help us get here today. Thank you to our sponsors uh, for helping to put on tonight, so uh, Red UK and uh, Triple Exposure and Storytailers. So, um, yeah, that's, that's really it, and, and to echo what Jean said, you know, Maria, Jay, Lauren, Emily, and then, of course, our writer-director, oh, I'm so used to this, man. <laughs> our writer-director, Jean, for having the vision. He picks this to me, uh, just to echo what you said, he picks this to me and Emily in a car in September, and then he laid down the gauntlet and said, we're gonna get this done to take it to Cannes. And there wasn't even a script in September, the fact that we were shooting it in January and then taking it to Cannes in May was, uh, was pretty remarkable, it's been a whirlwind. Um, but yeah, thank you to everyone involved. Thank you to you, mate, for your vision. And, uh, enjoy the film. for travelling far and wide, like we've got uh, JV, our editor and composer coming from Australia, which is amazing, thank you so much, thank you. Um, and yeah, this is just quite overwhelming, isn't it? 
Um, bat shit. Bat shit crazy. Um, yes, I just want to say a massive thank you. And yes, this film didn't exist like 12 months ago, which is crazy. But also, this team didn't exist 12 months ago. And I'm not going to get emotional. But I love each and every one of you. And this, like, yes, we produced a film, yay. But the film made our team. And for me, like, it's amazing. Like, you guys are my family. Love you Enjoy! Thank you very much, everyone.